This is the wall sh shower. Uh, it's a very small bathroom, but we made it work. Uh, custom tile. We used a Formica base there. Used a pedestal sink because there just wasn't very much room for anything else. Did a custom mirror and a custom cabinet over the toilet for extra storage since you used the pedestal. Wainscoting on the walls, tile on the floor, and the corner bench. Uh, and uh, that's brushed aluminum fixtures. and the seat. This is the Walsh kitchen. We refaced the cabinets. Uh, they're a maple. Just went over the existing cabinets. New countertop. Put a little tile over the countertop between the upper and the upper cabinets the countertop. Tile the floor. Um, she wanted some open shelves, some glass shelves on the other side. And the new sink and faucet. Uh, this is the Penna Kitchen. Uh, black cast iron sink. Um, dark it's a formica top, but it looks uh, like granite. We refaced the cabinets, put some glass in some of them. That's a maple shaker style refacing. That's where we just take the old cabinets and we put new doors on them and then new wood on the sides, new knobs. Um, then uh, new tile on the floor, new appliances or stainless appliances. This is the Pena living room. Um, we refaced the cabinets in the corners. They were painted white wood and we refaced them in uh, a natural oak. Uh, refinished the floor in uh, natural oak and then painted the room. This is the walker fiberglass tub wall surround. Uh, this was in a mobile home and he didn't have a lot of choices. His old tub was leaking real bad so he took that out. This is a uh, two or th I think it's a two piece tub wall unit um, made by I believe Lasco, real heavy duty fiberglass unit.
This is the Chapman bathroom. Most of the work we did here was on the shower um, and uh, the floor. This is a swing out door with the seat. Deco tile in the middle. A recessed soap dish. And I uh, grab bar, fiberglass base. Fiberglass base just makes it a little less expensive. He had a expensive uh, Kohler faucet with diverter and handheld shower unit. This is the Chaplin kitchen. Um, new countertop, new appliances. Those were his, his existing cabinets. He didn't want to change those. We had to rebuild the oven wall cabinet to fit the new cabinet, the new uh, appliances in. I mean, Swanstone countertop with undermounted sink. Um, Delta pull out faucet sprayer new lights over the sink this is McCullum bathroom um, did everything in this new floor new tub toilet new vanity vanity top tile over the tub with hand bars and deco tile recessed soap dish um, they had a window and they wanted to get rid of it and so we put a glass block window in there can't see through that Delta faucets with a hand shower safety bars they wanted a curtain instead of a door new vanity vanity top new faucet um, the medicine cabinet lights were original new towel bar and new door This is new vinyl on the floor. It looks like tile. A new oak heat register. New oak base molding. This is the Tallarico bathroom. Large tile on the floor custom shower base uh, we made a custom shower base because it was the space wasn't standard it was longer than the standard five feet uh, recessed soap handrail seat he used a shower curtain because the door wouldn't work because the space is too long. We did wainscoting on the wall. Uh, new vanity. New high toilet. We used the existing Madison cabinet, just fixed it up some just to keep the original look of the room.